ballots are likely on your coffee table tonight. When you open your ballot, you can expect a mind boggling number of provisions. More than half of those are merely housekeeping. Others will change how the city operates. But as KXLY 4's Colleen O'Brien reports, essentially they attempt to clarify and change rules made 11 years ago when Steve Eukster was a council member. We'll start numerically. Provision 1. It seeks to extend council term limits. For instance, in the case of Joe Shogan, he was a city council member, then council president. Two terms, that's it. If the provision passed... So this would say you can have two terms on the council as a council member, and you can also then have two terms as council president. Critic Steve Eugster thinks this is a good idea. After all, he says he came up with it. What about the mayor's salary? Provision 2. As a rule, the mayor makes what the highest city employee makes. However, theoretically, says Corker, the mayor appoints their own administrative lead. The mayor also sets that salary and could set it high to also benefit. All the other appointments have to be approved by the council. So it's a way of making sure there's not hanky pink like we had in California. Then there's the recall issue, Provision 3. I'm serving in the 3rd District and I can be recalled by the whole city. So two other districts could gang up on my district. If passed, the district that elects does the recalling. Steve Eugster disagrees. I think that once you are on the city council, you represent the entire city. He also thinks the 11 provisions are mostly a waste of time. How many more words can you add to something? If it's simple, if it's clear, why keep adding words to it? Don't we, 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 I guess we like to legislate where legislation is really not necessary. That was Colleen O'Brien reporting. Though Euster is strong in his opinions about the provisions, Councilmember Corker wants these rules clarified so future generations don't have to screw around with it as he put it. A description and thoughts from Corker and Euster on the 11 provisions are on our website, kxly.com.